kid all the time. Good afternoon, everybody. I, uh, I'm so proud to be here today. I want to thank Councilor Jack Lally for joining us here today. I want to thank all the wonderful city employees that are here today. Uh, today we celebrate the Republic of Cameroon. I want to thank Brian Mata and the team here for always, always helping us uh, with the podium and the flags. We will be raising the flag in just a short while, but um, I truly want to thank everybody uh, that's in attendance here today. Cameroon is a country in West Africa with a population of almost 27 million people. Cameroon is often referred to as, quote, Africa in the miniature, unquote, for its wide range of characteristics, including uh, linguistic diversity. There are 250 languages spoken in Cameroon, in addition to French and English. Cultural diversity, like Brockton, Cameroon is one of the most culturally diverse countries in all of Africa, and geological diversity. The landscape includes beaches, deserts, mountains, rainforests, and also savannas. The Cameroon national soccer team is known as the Indomitable Lions. The team has qualified for FIFA's World Cup eight times, more than any other African team uh, competing in World Cup competition. They also have won five different African Cup of Nations uh, titles. Just like all flags, the colors of Cameroon flags has a true meaning. Green, the lush forest. Red, unity. Star is the unity of the people themselves. And yellow is the sun and also the savannah. Cameroon was named by the Portuguese who marveled at the abundant amount of shrimp in the Wari River, which they called Rio de Cameros, meaning rivers of the shrimp. Traditional arts and crafts are practiced throughout the country from commercial, decorative, and also for religious purposes, including wood carvings and sculptures, pottery, weaving, uh, ceramics, beadwork, brass and bronze working, embroidery, and finally leather working. Until 1960, one part of Cameroon was a French territory and the other was a British territory. In 1960, French Cameroon achieved independence from France. In 1961, Great Britain relinquished control of southern Cameroon. On May 20th in the year 1972, the two parts unified to become one country known as the Republic of Cameroon. Today here in the city of Brockton, the city of champions, we celebrate and we recognize and we thank all Brockton residents and business owners who uh, immigrated from Cameroon or of Cam uh, Cameroonian descent. Brockton's true strength is in our diversity and the Cameroonian people are truly a part of that. We wanna thank each and every one of them for sharing their culture, the cuisine, and of course, their great traditions to all of us here in our city. And it adds to the unique, unique vibrancy of our special city. Uh, I'm now gonna read the official proclamation uh, and then followed by raising the, the flag of the Republic of Cameroon. Mayoral proclamation, whereas Cameroon was liberated from French rule 1960 and from British rule 1961, an act that demonstrated the resolute spirit that has characterized the Cameroonian culture through the ages. Whereas the growth and prosperity of Brockton, Massachusetts in the Commonwealth is due in part to an ethnic diversity which includes the Cameroonian population. Whereas the city of Brockton, the city of champion, has been greatly enriched by the introduction of Cameroonian customs, foods, and culture brought here by dedicated Cameroonian immigrants that are residents and business owners and truly made an indelible mark on our city. It is an honor to recognize the accomplishments and the contributions of our great citizens of Cameroonian ancestry and to extend them best wishes to continued success and prosperity in our commonwealth, in our county, in our city, and more importantly, in our country. Now, therefore, I, Robert F. Sullivan, as mayor of the city of Brockton, proclaim today, June 30th, in the year 2023, in the city of Brockton, as Cameroonian flag commemoration day and I respectfully urge all residents in our fine city to please join me in observing this special day. And I proudly sign and seal the proclamation again on the 30th day of June, 2023. Robin F. Sullivan, Mayor of the City of Brock. And again, I want to thank all of you for being here today. Uh, we will uh, take, a, take a short recess before we raise the Cameroonian flag. And again, I want to thank Thomas from Brock and Community Access for always joining us uh, at these flag raisings. So again, thank you. Have a special uh, weekend, and again, uh, on next week, next Tuesday, is the national holiday, the 4th of July, and again, uh, July 5th is the uh, Independence Day for our Cape Verde and residents and business owners as well. So today, we honor the Republic of Cameroon. Thank you, and be well.
words? Do you want to say yeah. any words? Um, what else can I say? I just want to thank you guys for honoring this day, being here today, and uh, I'm sure the entire Cameroonian community, they would have been here. There's a lot of Cameroonians, a lot of them. They would, I mean, they would, the whole of this area would have been packed. But then, um, hey, in honor of all the Cameroonian com community here in Brockton, and Mr. Mayor, thank you thank so you. very much for making this day happen. And um, as uh, a representative of Cameroon, we are a very peace loving people. We are humble people and uh, very hospitable. You'll get to know us more with time. And I uh, hope we extend that relationship and be able to be of uh, great um, production and you know, do good things to, to the city. We want to thank you all. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. Thank you all for coming. And Thank you. Now at this time, we're going to proudly uh, raise the Republic of Cameroon flag. I'm going to have Ernie do the duties. We're going to go over to the podium, I mean over to the flagpole at this time. Thank you.